morning and welcome to the live stream. My name is Pamela Stewart. I'm an author of young adult science fiction and fantasy and today we're going to do some sprints. Huzzah! Welcome to you all you early morning writers. I'm so happy to have you. I have some special news. Oh and for those of you who are new this is the unicorn horn of success and it will be bestowed upon anyone who uh, participates in our 25 minute timed writing sprints. Well, good morning, Shadow Heart. How are you? Wow, you're an early riser too. I only do this because of work. Actually, I've found that this is a productive time for me, which is why you should always keep experimenting with different times that you might be productive. Uh, because honestly, I did not think, because I still feel very cotton candy brain. <laughs> I'm very cotton candy brain this morning. So, but I guess this is what creativity feels like. <laughs> but I get like a thousand words sometimes before work in the morning, and that's fantastic. So I'm not going to chat too much because um, I do have to go to work at about 730. So we need to Squeeze in some sprints. Um, let's see, what have I been doing so far? I <laughs> woke up and I got this beautiful, this is beautiful coffee. What are you guys drinking today? Share your beverage of choice. Nothing's better than the first cup of coffee, to be honest with you. It just perks up my very soul. Well, I'm excited to be here and I'm excited to announce, yeah, definitely coffee, that I have finished my short story that I had been working on. I got really um, into it and I just powered on to the end. Now the fun part begins. These prints I'm going to be using for doing editing. So, because I need to get this done. I actually got my edits back for Cadet too. So I have a lot on, of editing on my plate. Uh, while I'm editing Cadet, I want to be plotting the next book. So I have lots going on in my brain uh, and I need to be very focused uh, with adding extra words here and taking away the right amount of words, which is probably key for me. What are you working on? So I'm doing an edit of Space Pirates this morning. What you working on, Shadowheart? <laughs> I'm trying on a new angle today too, so you can guys see my book. One of one of my five bookshelves. Good morning. Good to see you this morning, Shay Lynn. Hopefully, you have your coffee or other beverage of choice, and you are ready to go hard or go home. We're working on the YA fantasy still. Fantastic. I like it when I see people working on the same things so they can uh, get their projects completed. And that's what these sprints are all about. The Pomodoros. I am ready for action. Are you ready for action? What you're working on, Shaylin? Let's give you some FaceTime here, Shadow. And even if you're watching this later in the day, when everyone wakes up, feel free to join in, tell us about your projects below, and share your work counts, because I love to give positive feedbacks, and the unicorn horn of success is for everyone. <laughs> because we are here, we are doing the work, we're getting up early, and we're going to hit it before we even get outside, before the sun even rises. Good God almighty. Good God. Well, I'm feeling it. I, I heard a montage of 80s dance music this morning. That was my wake up call. So I'm feeling very MC Hammer and very high energy. So hope you are too. If not, we're going to get there. 25 minutes 
is a good time, I think. And I used to do a warm up one, but I think that the just jumping right in and getting your feet wet. This is called jumping in the pool, folks. Jumping into the pool. I am ready. Are you? Get your word processors up. Or if you're working in a notebook, pull out your notebooks. If you're doing dictation or editing, get those documents ready. Be thinking about the next section you want to work on. Be thinking about some things you want to add or subtract. Get yourself immersed in the story. And I personally can't listen to soundtracks, but if you need music, turn that on. Just leave me on in the background if that's helpful. There might be guest stars of my cats, but this is their sleepy time. So we might not see guest starring Petunia and, and Oliver, but you never know. I am ready. Hope you are too, because this is it. This is it. This is the moment that we've all been waiting for. This is where we put in the work. This is where we get in the foxholes and we actually roll in the deep. So, I am ready. I keep telling myself, it, it's, it's positive psychology. I'm telling myself I'm ready, whether I think I am or not. And that, fake it till you make it, folks. Fake it till you make it. All right. 25 on the clock. If you join in later, just jump right in. You won't hear this until later. All right. I still have morning brain, okay? This coffee is not kicking in yet. 25 on the clock. On your mark. Get set. Sprint. Ah.
Oh. And that, my friends, is time. How did you do? I am back on editing this morning, so I got a couple pages edited. This is really my first rough, rough draft of the short story Space Pirate Rising. And I actually, it came together really good by the end, but the beginning still needs to reflect where the end is. So I'm trying to just read through it and, and just kind of obvious problems right now. So I feel like that was great progress for the morning. And again, surprisingly, some of my most creative time. Who knew? Who knew? How did y'all do? Share it in the comments. Well, if for no one else, I'm giving myself a little unicorn horn of achievement. Because you know what? We're doing the work. We're getting up early. We are getting the editing done. We're getting the words in. We are thinking through our stories. And now it looks like the sun is peeking out. I'm starting to get some more light outside and I can feel the wheels turning. How about you guys? Energy level rising. Woo, go shadow, go shadow. Woo, woo, go shadow, go shadow, go shadow. Go shadow. Ow! You could, I, I did mention I was listening to 80s music. <laughs> we, got, we got a little Michael Jackson creep in there a little bit. Amazing. You got two? What? What? Brenda, that's fantastic. Unicorn horn of success for you. All right. Let's officially bestow this upon everyone in the stream. Thank you for showing up and doing the work. Life is now a musical, and we are enjoying <laughs> being alive today. Yes, I hear music in my head. And good morning to all of you again. Space Pirate Rising is moving along very well. I'm hoping to get it done by the weekend so then I can shimmy over to Cadet and get that ready for publication. I can't even wait. You guys are both amazing. Did I make sure, I want to make sure we got, we, we gave you the proper kudos. Now, if you're watching this later, welcome. Thank you for coming. If you like live streams, please like and subscribe below. It really helps me out. And I, hopefully I am encouraging. And FYI, this Saturday, I usually do a live stream at four, but because they're doing the worldwide uh, write a thon, which I unfortunately don't stay up on things because of my day job. So I must have missed out on that one. So I don't want to get on anyone's stream. Like, so I'm just going to go ahead and participate with other people. I'm going to just go and enjoy the stream and try to get as much done on Saturday as I can. There's going to be so many going on that uh, I think you'll have an opportunity to find one, but. There uh, may be the beginning of next week. I will definitely have another one. So I'm definitely still doing one a week. And then we're back on the Saturday schedule as soon as possible. Yeah, there's a lot of great streams out there. Kate Cavanaugh does one. Brooke Passamore does them sometimes. I like Kate's a lot. I feel like she really gets a lot of good stuff done. So this weekend, yeah, there'll be lots of streams going on at all times of day. But mine will be postponed until next week sometime. Yay, yes. I'm guessing it will be, it will not hit the, it will not hit the market or it won't be widely available until October because I am also working on an audiobook for Conscript, which I want to launch around the same time. So trying to negotiate all this indie publishing stuff and keeping everything in alignment is is fun as it's like I'm, I'm my own publisher as well as publicist as well as writer as well as producer as well as editor 
But the good news about Cadet is that my editor actually gave me a thumbs up and encouraged me less because she's like, man, this is clean. This is good. I really like this. And so that is very encouraging. Now, it's a long book, too. So um, and the goal is while I'm editing that, I'm also going to be outlining book three. So I have that ready for my nano project. So I have a lot. Of, I have projects for the end of the year. And I know we have two, both of you all working on YA fantasy. So that's cool. I think eventually I want to do fantasy too, because I love fan fantasy is actually what I read the most, which is funny that I don't write it right now, but I enjoy the space opera and I'm reading right now. And this will be a quickie because I know it's, we need to get back into another stream, but uh, deviate. And it's in the lifelike series by Jay Kristoff. I don't know if you've ever read Illuminae series. But it's the second book in the Lifelike series. And I really enjoyed the first book, although it was a little dystopian-y, dystopian if that's even a word. And um, it really had a surprise ending. So I am enjoying book two. I'm listening to that audio book on my way to work every day. So I'm trying to get some reading time in. And I'm also secretly reading Midnight Sun. Don't, don't. Don't, don't shame me. I just want to find out what happens, okay? Any good books out there that you're reading? Feel free to share them in the comments, even later. I would love to have, I always like to increase my reading list because there's always something out there that I've not heard about, some indie book or recent um, release that I don't know about or a book that got published a few years ago, even then, like I'm so involved in working and in writing that I miss a lot of what's happening out there. So feel free to share. All right, kids, let's do another sprint because I am feeling like my brain is on, is, is almost online now. And the coffee, uh, my little coffee warmer. Okay. Fun, fun, fun fact. And a little tip. If you like work, hot coffee, which I like warm coffee. And I, once it gets cold, I won't drink it. I got this little coffee warmer and I didn't think I would really use it or wouldn't be that big a deal. Game changer, man. Game changer. It makes the coffee taste fresh all the time. It makes me so happy. All right, cats and kittens, take a swig of whatever you're drinking. Think about the next scenes and what you want to either edit in or delete out, which is what I'm doing and making sure that the beginning reflects the end. I'm trying to get ready for maybe some weekend critiquing. Who knows? I might even have some ready for that to send out to my critique partners. Hopefully, if I can whip this into shape, I will have something. All right, kids, word processors up. And we're gonna do Pomodoro 2. And let me get the timer all set here. All right, on your marks. Take a swig, shake it out. Let's get another good sprint in before the kids wake up or the animals decide they want to attack you or you have to get off to work. It's time. For the words. On your mark, get set, go.
see. Is your caffeine kicking in? Because mine's starting to. And with the rising of the sun, we are getting it done. Oh, my God. I am not a poet, but that was kind of fun. <laughs> How did you do in the last sprint, my friends? Please share below. I got about two more pages edited. I'm starting to feel through the story. Oh, I made so many notes. Cut and move this section. Like it was easy to do this. Because then you have to put it back in the new section. Any word counts out there. I'd love to see them. Love to see them. Show me your word counts so I can get excited for you. It's always kind of weird when Oliver doesn't join me. He is caught. Like he had his nice breakfast. I'm going to give myself the unicorn of success because getting up this early is a major achievement. Woo! Shadow. Go shadow. Go shadow. Go. Go. Go shadow. You MVP. Double thumbs up from me to thee. You're right, fantasy, you know the these and those and all that. I hope I'm not too disjointed this morning. I hope I am still being motivational for y'all. Yay, Brenda! Woo! The unicorn of success is also for you. The unicorn, there's enough unicorn horn of success for everyone. One for you, and one for you, and one for you. Okay. I actually have to leave for work in about 20 minutes. So let's do a quick 15 minute -er. And close is out strong. And I know this is not a true Pomodoro, but we're going to have to just... This is what we got to work with, kids. And that'll give me time to... Hot foot it. Hopefully you do not have to go to work today and you can spend the rest of the day writing. But if not, happy travels. Come back and, and stay. Uh, come back and do another live stream with me sometime. If you have to leave early, I appreciate you for showing up this morning. And if you're watching this later, I appreciate you using it as motivation for your writing day. Okay, I think I got 15 minutes on the clock. Yes, I do. Do, 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 do. I'm proud of everyone who showed up this morning. And then when you get to work or you spend the rest of your day, you've already got some things done. And you can go through the day and not even feel guilty at all, which is my MO. So it's nice to have it off my plate. And then I can dig into some other things like plotting the next book or setting up my social media or doing any of that stuff. So getting the writing in early when your mind is fresh is a, is a good technique I'm finding. So hopefully that's helpful to you. And here we go. 15 minutes on the clock. Just going to be 15 more minutes. You can do anything for 15 minutes. This is not even as long as a sitcom, guys. You scrolled uh, uh, on Facebook for more than 15 minutes. So we can definitely give ourselves 15 minutes. All right. On your mark. Get set. Hit it.
that, my friends, is time. How did you do? Share your beautiful numbers in the comments because I want to give you the unicorn horn of success because you deserve it. Early morning riders, share your numbers. I got two more pages edited, so I'm thinking this 25 minute or even, well, I did almost as much as I did in the 25 minute and 15. So maybe the shorter sprints might even be a way to go, but yay, early morning sprinting for the win. Put your numbers in the comments. Oliver's grooming, our time is short. Also, reality is calling my name. I try to ignore it, but it does not heed. <laughs> heed my desire to not, to not have to go to work today. So I do have to vacate here in a minute. But thank you all for showing up this lovely day. I hope that you found this super productive and you got lots of words and editing done. I know I did. Thank you for being here to motivate me because I don't know if I would have. <gasps> Yay, Shadow! Woo! 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 Here's your spirit fingers. And here is your jazz hands. This is a Macarena something. Go, Shadow. You did it. You did it. Hooray. <laughs> You're the Jorah of this, this live stream. Another chapter. Brenda, you are fire this morning. You were on fire, and I'm so proud of you. Well done, guys. Well done. Thank you for being here. Wow. What a great start today, huh? And thank you for sharing it with me. Now go coffee up. Get ready for another fun and productive day. I will be back next week. I promise. Um, not Saturday because of the issue with the worldwide sprinting going on um, on YouTube, but I will definitely be back next week. And the next, the Saturday after that, I am back on schedule. Regardless of what else happens, we're back on schedule. So be looking for the live streams. Please like and subscribe. It really helps me out. Thank you so all. Have a wonderful day. Love you all. Mwah, 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 mwah. See you soon. Uh, bye.